All right, I'm I'm recording now. Let's get twenty one forty five, baby. Okay, so this guy, I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna play this because I can do the same trick, I think. So please play knight f six, and then once I play something fun like h three, okay, he doesn't. So I'm just gonna play d four. Also, you can click on my. Okay. I think I played Atomic a little while ago and I was all right at it. I don't quite remember. Uh, let's just get my bishop here. Because I don't think they're going to... Yeah, you know, he, ju he just was really good at it. Please take d4. Uh, please take d4 or push. If you push your pawns, I might like that too. Yeah, okay, good. So that's one castling side less for him. Now, do I want to play this? Do I want to play a4? Yay, you did it. Okay, let's see. Here. Okay. You became fucky wucky in the brain. Okay, here. 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 I'm going to take. Oh yeah, do you want me to give you a link? Here, here's the link to my game, by the way. Now you can see me. Okay. Um... Yep. Okay, I'm gonna... Yeah, that was like uh, for the qualifiers for like the official Clash Royale tournament, I think. Right? Where you, if you got in the top 20, you could contest. But I wasn't 18, so... Yeah, for a little bit. And there was one tourney where I ended like 40th, which is pretty nice. Yep, I was. Uh, yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play this. Because I don't want knight c5. And then I'm going to play bishop a4 and threaten to take. So, okay, I can just play bishop a4. And I can push my pawns and I can win. Like, this is not too hard, I think. This is already a pretty winning game for me. Just got to get all my pieces out and just wallop him. Then he's going to cry. He can play king d8. King d8 might actually be... Pretty good for him. <laughs> what did... Oh, cool. That's kind of a cool flex, you know? Okay, so can I push the pawn? Uh, 
Uh, no, I just want to push pawns and win. Uh, I think I can do that now still. I mean, I can play pawn d6, knight takes, and no, queen takes. So pawn takes, queen takes, and then... You mean c6? And then knight d8. And my queen is attacked. So, I mean, I can keep threatening it. So... I think I'm going to take this pawn first. If he takes with the knight, I'll take his queen, and he takes my queen, and I take his rook. If he takes with the queen, well, right now I can exchange it. But I think... Well, what do I want to play here? Hmm... play rook here rook here yep okay he takes takes so okay if i take he takes and then i take and then king takes and then bishop takes okay i win a piece and then i'm gonna take here and then i'm gonna take here and i am a piece up completely winning in the end game uh knight here if he pushes his pawn i take his pawn and then he takes my pawn and i take his bishop Um, then I just put the king up and I'm winning. I mean, it's two against one, so it's winning. No need to think hard about it. Yeah, sometimes. Okay, so the king wants to go there. And then I just protect with my bishop. Where? Here. I think, right? Yeah. Here, and then I can protect here. Here. Uh oh, lost a piece. Oh no. Well, that's tragic. Too bad I'm still going to win the game. Like, I can even blunder a bishop, but because I'm two pawns up, I'm just winning. Uh, just gonna go here. He can, he's allowed to take my pawn there, you know. He can give a check, and then I'll take his pawn. And I'm just gonna keep taking his stuff. And then he's gonna cry. I'm like, yeah, what, what can I do? The only thing I allow myself to do is to win. And I sure as hell do fucking win. Okay, so just bishop here. Now I have all the pawns. I win. Yay. Okay, so... Nope, not yet. First I want to block the king from going forward, I think. 
show here no oh i know which pawn to go forward with this one the king isn't close enough yeah i i, I thought like g5 g4 g yeah okay well thank you <laughs> new record baby new fucking record okay let's keep playing i'm just gonna keep playing until i lose my record does that sound good? Just gonna keep playing, you know, bam, bam, bam. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Damn. The working class have it hard. Luckily, I'm not of the working class. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Mostly I just want to relax in life. So basically as long as I can relax in life, I'm happy. Ooh, yay. I love this opening. Get all the pawns. Woohoo. Okay, push it here. Okay, he's gonna do that. And I'm just gonna play risky. No, wait. Okay, I waited. Good job, me. I waited. Yes. Because I don't want the knight to go to c6, I want it to go to something ridiculous like a6 after I play a3. That's the fun thing. So, okay. And now? No, wait! Hey, Teo. I'm gonna win the night. Woo! I win! I am the best! Lamau, got him. Um... Yeah, that does sound like a good idea, but, um... What? What? Wiki page? What about it? Oh. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my queen back, queen has open file, I'm going to play knight f3. I'm going to play knight f3. I'm going to play bishop d3, and then I'm going to castle. And I'm happy. Like the 21-23 is already getting desperate. That's kind of dumb. And maybe if he plays queen f6, maybe I can play some, like, nice knight g. Okay, I'm just going to put my bishop here then. I'm going to put my bishop here, and I'm going to threaten a discovery attack or on something. Probably. And now I'm going to castle. It's all going to be great. So, okay. If he plays bishop b4, I'm going to play bishop d2. <sighs> and he can play bishop b4 without me taking with my pawn, because then my rook will get taken. Basically, I'm going to play b4. Later, I'm going to get my bishop out, and I'm just going to attack everything. So, you know... Yeah, my bishop to a bit of a passive square, but at least the knight defends. His bishop sucks, my bishop sucks, everything sucks. We all deserve to die. 
So I'm just going to play this. Simple thread, C5, fork. No, wait, an even better thread. C5, queen stuck. That's a good thread. So basically, if he plays bishop f4, c5, and I win the queen. He literally has no squares then. So yeah, I'm completely winning this one. And then I'm going to have the legendary 2150. Yay. Isn't that amazing? That is. Okay, so he does that. And then, of course, I'm going to play the most rational move, which is to win a piece. And then I have the bishop here. And if he goes there, yeah, he needs to take my bishop. If he takes my knight, he's going to lose. And he takes my knight. So I'm going to take with the bishop. So the queen needs to go to a6. Oh, no, wait. He just... Oh. And Gambit's another piece. Now I have two pieces. Um, and now I'm just going to... I'm going to attack his um, b7 pawn. Because I need to attack pawns. Did you know that once in a game I played an opening against the 2000 where I sacrificed three of my pieces? Then I got like three pawns or something and then I checkmated him. It was fucking hilarious. Okay, and now this just wins. Like if he goes king here, I think bishop g5 is checkmate. Oh, no, it isn't. Because the queen can block. And then I take the queen, he takes with the pawn. Or no, I don't even take the queen. Okay, he gave up. 2151! I did it! Yay. Bye. Okay, might as well then go offline. Here's my channel content, I guess. And let's just keep playing until I lose. So 2151, that's great. Okay, I'm just going to play my usual thing. Where, wow, and then you can play the knight, but he doesn't. So I'm going to play in the center. You can counter that, I suppose. If he plays the knight here, he doesn't. Smart move. I'm going to play the knight here. I'm just going to play the pawn here. Just take space. And then just be happy. A happy man with some happy amount of space. Then I can block this part. If he plays h6, I'm going to play queen, bishop h4. If he plays g5, then I can just turn back and just enjoy a nice game, you know? <coughs> Okay, bad move from my part. Knight f5. So now I'm just going to take the knight. So 
No, bishop here takes, takes. He gets both bishops, and I can play a I tree. Okay, I just take. Not quite the opening I wanted, but I mean, bad bishop. This bishop will get attacked by my pawns. I got better pawn play, so, you know. Bishop. Oh, maybe I was wrong. Maybe I should have taken with the pawn, you know, because I actually would be able to. Oh, no. This is nice. So basically what I want to do is I want to get my queen in and then threaten this mate and get on this diagonal somehow. Um... Basically, I want to get my bishop in here and get my rook in there.
I think this is the move that I want. And my problem is I am not sure that I'm actually safe. I just know that f6 doesn't work and that I'm threatening e7 or g7. Then I'm fine with either and I just want the king to be in a perilous position. And my g4 move does help that. It's all the things I wanted to know. If he wants to check me, he can go ahead. Here, I'll even pre-move it. Because what else is he going to do? Does he want to give me a check? If queen takes here, then I have this move and then this move. <coughs> so, okay, at least I don't have to worry about that. Because this knight is so out of play and the king is in the center, I am going, I am in a winning position, even though I'm down material. Like if his knight was here, or was here, I'd be in a losing position by far. But his knight is doing this, and it's staring at this pawn, it's looking at a square it can go to, it's protecting garbage, and its movement is nothing. I mean, I don't even consider this too bad a move, aside from the fact that you'd need to do this in order to be safe. But I mean, knight g8 might be a pretty alright thing to do. Um, but if that happens, I'm just going to take all the pawns and just push. I put my queen here, exchange, I don't know. You can also just literally put his queen here. Same thing, really. Then he can actually fight back. And I don't know. I, I, I can't see who's better at that point. But that's only if he sees that. Seeing as how much time he's taking, he hasn't seen his... Um, well, he's pretty much at least equalizing move. Like, okay, you go here, I take, here, and then what? I move out of the way? What? So wait, can I checkmate him now? Well, firstly, this doesn't matter, so I can just go here and check. So let's just start with that. Yeah, sure. And I guess let's just take the knight. Maybe there was a checkmate here, but I just didn't see it because queen here just doesn't work. 
So I just have, you know, an extra piece and I'm happy. He can take my pawn, I can take his pawn. He can push and I can push and we can all push, push, push. Um, actually, I don't want to take here, I want to take here because, you know, threats. Getting the center barrage. So, of course, I'm going to take this pawn closer. And then this is a draw. Did I do the wrong move? Yep. Well, you got me. I can't move out of this. I can't put my pawn here. I can only do this and then do this. And it's a draw. Lost no points, so I can play a new one. After all, the only reason this video stops is if I lose points. Well, the draw gave lost me some center points, but not actual points. Okay, me gotta be. Push. Here, same idea. Knight here, push this pawn. And then if takes, check, and I win. Nope. Any way I can punish that? Answer is probably. Yep, let's put the knight here. The yes, issue is that if push, 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 well, I can do knight here, I can take. Let's just take here. Okay, no. Let's just protect this. And castle. And then move my knight in. So let's see. Takes, 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 takes here. Hmm. Not quite convinced of it yet. Maybe if I go here, takes, 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 here, here. Yeah, let's do this. It's quite a cool move. Calm and collected. Okay. So he doesn't allow me to take there. That's fine. Just gonna move my knight here. I also have another protector for this. So we push, push. Boom. Cool.
Now if he plays queen here, then I must applaud him, that's a pretty good move. I won't applaud him for that one. Patience. Take. Here, 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 here. I don't th think I see what he thinks that he complimented and he gains with that. Just going to push anyway.
Okay, so that's just a piece. Can't play Queen takes G2 because my knight defends. You didn't see that. After that, I'm going to play bishop e4, trade the bishops. Even if queen here, I can just push the pawn. Okay. I'm going to take so that he doesn't have an extra defender for that square. And then I'm going to take. 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 Check. Here. This king still has no defenders and I have some attackers. So I'm not sure how he's going to defend that. I think every next move is checkmate. So, all right, I'm going to give him the early on gg you know just the disrespect well i guess it's not really disrespect it's more just like um a signal that he needs to give up because most of the time if i say gg they give up or like pretty often they do that a completely lost position and they're like yeah yeah you're right Gonna be a bit honest, you know. Like maybe ninety five protects because you could play this. Though I can also, you know, give a check here, give a check here, or no, even like give a check here. And then he goes here, and then I can go here after the knight goes here. And then after going here. Okay, uh, I'm winning. I'm just going to stop the video because I don't want my laptop to cry. Or maybe it's best to let it run. Because I don't want my thing to crash in the middle of the game. Um, yeah. I'm just going to stop the recording, hope for the best.